good seeing you guys again, huh? <laughs> oh man, welcome to another episode of the DJ Chronicles with your boy, Jimmy Hustle. And I hope you guys have been alright. Um, I've been doing good. I believe I haven't seen you guys since November when we did that way. So a lot has changed since then. Um, I hope this year will be a whole lot better. But, um, you know, we're still going through it. Still going through this pandemic. So, um, I know a lot of you guys have been going through some things. And pretty much I've been going through the same. Um, I've had relatives that have been sick. And still sick. Um, I even have some close people in my family that have passed. And, and it's, it's getting crazy out here, man. It's really getting crazy. But still, I give God the glory and the honor. Because, um... You know, I'm still in my good health, and I'm still able to push forward, man. So, I'm not complaining, and I won't complain. And I hope you guys are doing all right as well. I hope you guys are still pushing through. I pray that you still um, <laughs> are looking up and strapped down and holding on to this roller coaster called life, man, because it is something else. But um, as far as for me, you know, I've just been hanging on and doing other things. Um, Y'all know I've been doing music, but um, I've also been um, playing instruments. Um, I started back in January, like the beginning of January of this year. And um, I said, I'm going to learn the piano. I want to learn the piano. So I went out and bought a piano. Don't know nothing about it. I bought it anyway. And um, I've been um, learning with my sister, Ashley. She's been coming out and... um, teaching me different things and giving me lessons so a big shout out to her so I'm learning a whole lot quicker due to that and like one of my goals like I really want to learn how to play songs um, with reading sheet music and stuff like that so like one of my favorite songs that I want to learn right now and the very first song that I want to learn is uh, John Legend um, All of Me I want to learn that song really bad and I wonder what that will sound like when I do learn. Hmm. That's all I'm gonna show y'all. That's all I'm gonna show y'all, man. Y'all don't need to see no more, man. Y'all don't need to see no more, man. Tell tell the ARs, don't sign me yet. Don't sign me yet. <laughs> oh man, I'm just playing that. But yeah, man, it's fun on the piano, man. Just having some good times, learning new songs and stuff like that, man. So shout out to my music instructor teaching me the lessons, giving me those good lessons, man, Miss Ashley. My sister, man, she's been coming out um, on a weekly basis, just uh, teaching me some new things, man. So shout out to her. I appreciate you so much. And um, it's just teaching me something new, man. So I'm having a lot of fun doing that. But other than that, today we have a new event uh, with my homegirl Jade and All About You Staffing. Uh, We are doing the Signature Experience event. This is an event that we do every year. And... um, This event is pretty much for all the bartenders. Um, They will be showcasing their signature drinks and um, all of the participants will come out, have those drinks, and then they will be able to vote on the drink that they like the most. And the one that gets the most votes will win a prize. So it's a nice event, man. Um, I have fun doing it every year. Um, This year is different, of course, because of COVID. Um, So I know Jay was kind of shaky about whether she was going to do it or not. But she finally pulled the trigger and said, I'm going to do it. So we're going to make it happen today. Um, It's going down at 3 o'clock and it will end at 6. So right now it is around 11 o'clock. So um, I'm about to go and... uh, Take a shower and shave and all that good stuff and put on some clothes and then we're going to head out. going to load up the van and get everything situated, man. So, hope you guys are ready. 
to work once again, man, because I need some help. So let's get out here and load up this van. So buckle up your seatbelts. Let's ride. Everything is loaded up in the van. It is now 12.05 and uh, the event does not start until 3. And I expect to be at the venue no later than 1 o'clock, which will give me two hours to set up. So we are looking very good on time. I know some people was asking me, what do I think about this event? Do I think it's gonna turn out pretty good? And I actually do, um, for a lot of reasons. Um, you know, we going through this whole COVID-19 thing and everybody was scared at first when it first hit but now <laughs> there's a lot of people just want to get out the house so it's not a lot of things that's happening right now so when something do happen everybody is flocking to it so i do expect a big turnout for this one um and i do expect the um the ticket sales to go pretty good so i have high hopes about this one and i'm just excited to get out the house myself so i know everybody else is i have a dj and i don't know how long? I think uh, November was my last time DJing. So, I am very excited to uh, get out this house and do some mixes, man. So, uh, I'm having very good vibes about it. Um, my homeboy D is supposed to come out again and help me with the camera. So, hopefully y'all will get some good uh, camera angles <laughs> this time around. So, uh, everything is looking good, man. Everything is looking good. I even invited um, some of my coworkers, man. So I'm gonna see if they come out this time. I don't do a lot of events where I can invite people. So when I do, I try to invite some people, man. So I'm gonna see if they come out, man. We'll see. But other than that, I'm gonna focus on this road. And uh, I'm gonna talk to y'all later, all right? <laughs> Peace. Somebody ready to have fun? Always! Always! You know I'm smiling up under here too. Yeah, right? I, see it. I can see it in your ass. <laughs> You're smizing, brother. You're smizing. Thank you for that in advance. 
Um, just to give you a little bit of background about the Signature Experience, we are here to kind of showcase our hospitality for all of you. We have couples here from Briar Expos, we have some of our clientele, buyers for New Year's Eve parties. We just wanted to have a variety mix up and just help you guys get out of the house. It's been a really stressful 12 months, haven't we? Glad that you guys came through. We are definitely making sure we're safe with our gloves and our masks. And overall, we definitely want to get some feedback. So please vote for the bartenders that you like the most based on drink, presentation, taste, and of course hospitality. And then outside of that, if you guys have any comments you want to find Rob and I and tell us what you think about the event or what we could do better, we're always open to feedback as well. We try to do it at least biannually, so we look forward to your participation in the future. First off, bartenders, y'all did y'all thing today, and I'm really, 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 so I'm going to go ahead and refresh my polls right now because it is live real time on the boats. Amber, our bar manager, you in? All right, cool. So without further ado, I'm going to announce who our winner is. And this winner gets a cash prize in this lovely envelope right here. And our winner is, y'all ready? Drum roll. Drum roll. Drum roll. Drum roll. Hey. Mella. Appreciate you so much for stepping up tonight. All right. Especially going through the pandemic, man, and just being out once again, it was a good day. And my predictions were right. <laughs> they came in there, and they was ready to drink and party and everything else, man. They was ready from the time they walked through the door. So it was a good event, man. It was very good. So shout out to All About You staffing for seeing this event through. And shout out to all the bartenders. <laughs> for doing your thing. Um, everybody said they had a good time. And um, some compliments came back to me and said um, I did a good job with the music. So that was good. And I think I have some potential clients too. So Dreamwalking Entertainment is on the move, man. So I'm very excited about that. Shout out to my homeboy, Davin, for getting on the camera once again, giving you guys some good shots. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm pretty sure you got some good shots. I already know, just the stuff that I saw, and I saw him get it. <laughs> 
So I already know, man. So shout out to you, bro. And um, yeah, it was a good night. But um, other than that, I know some people want to know what I have been up to. And besides me uh, trying to play John Legend on the piano, um, I've been working hard at Dreamwalking Entertainment. And um, I have been um, getting into filming. Um, I like filming and recording stuff. So um, I've been working on that. And uh, me and my homeboy Davin did team up to shoot a music video. Uh, we did our first music video under Dreamwalking Entertainment. Everything was in-house. We did that last year um, under the group name Dreamwalkers, which is me and two other Christian hip hop artists under Dreamwalking Entertainment. We formed a group called the Dreamwalkers and we put out a song called Keep Your Eyes On Me. If you haven't heard it, please go check it out on Spotify, iTunes, or you can check it out on the Dreamwalking fan page. Um, that was our first in-house music video and it came out really good. So we're gonna keep pushing and keep making more music videos and you will see other videos from us as well. So um, we are getting that up and off the ground. And um, I am also doing DJ mixes. So if you want a custom DJ mix, you can holler at me for that. I'm doing it for $20 an hour. So all you do is, of course, pay for it. And then you tell me what you want, and I will mix it up for you and um, send it right back to you through email. It's just that simple. Um, also, under Dreamwalker Entertainment, we provide photography and aerial photography, so, which is the drones. So we can do drone shots for you and drone videos. And um, what else we can do? We can do some other stuff. But that's, com that's coming on later on. <laughs> we got to work on it. But those are the top things that we do right now. And we just gonna keep pushing, man. You already know we doing the DJ services. And um, hey, man, we just gonna see what 2021 do. So other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the DJ Chronicles, man. And I hope to see you guys very soon. Hopefully it will not be as long as it was in the past. <laughs> so we gonna pray for the better, all right? <laughs> but until then, I'm gonna see y'all later, all right? Peace.